please. Uh, you lost a pee. <laughs> <laughs> it fell off somewhere. <laughs> exactly. Um, it's it's a job that you that you do by passion, and whether you are a woman, a man, uh, it doesn't matter. You have to be passionate about what you do and to make it as you want it. And how long have you been a winemaker? Eleven years now. I have the future still uh, in front of me, but um, 11 years were uh, enough to see different vintages, different kind of vintages, and uh, warm, cold, um, very, very healthy, uh, more with uh, rot, and so it's, uh, it's a good experience already. Uh, since 1780, so I'm the eighth generation. It's not that heavy um, because it wasn't an obligation. So I, I do it by by pleasure and and with pleasure. I was um, rather um, uh, in a, in an optic of doing research in biology, which is not exactly the same thing, but it, which is not not far away because it's biology and it's physiology of vines and yeah but it it was also not a the thing that I, I never I never thought okay I will be a winemaker it, it, it took me time to to really um, be aware of what I wanted to do because when you're studying at high school it's it's too early you just study you enjoy what you what you study and, and that's it we produce some uh, 5,000 cases a year, which is nice and uh, pretty, pretty interesting because uh, small estate means uh, uh, kind of management of, of everything. So I'm involved in the vineyards, in the winery, uh, in the sales. Yeah, sure. Working in the vineyard is a, is a pleasure because you're you're in the in the countryside. You're uh, just just in the nature, not disturbed by any phones or everything, and that's really uh, peaceful. I mean, of course, some some periods are quite stressful because nowadays in in May June when it's growing like crazy, uh, we make really long hard days uh, to do the de debating trellising but it's really interesting and then uh, harvest is a period where it's really exciting because it's everything the, the work of a whole year is uh, played at this time and that's really interesting yeah. never interesting. never yeah. and even when we taste when we make the blend uh, with my parents we never see numbers at, at first we taste blind uh, 15 20 samples that we prepared uh, prior to the tasting and and then we just uh, we just go finer to find the, the the real blend but from the beginning we don't know what what's in that bottle or in this one it's um, it's true. It's what we feel and what we like. 